Doomsday Glacier. In Antarctica could melt quickly. Thwaites Glacier in Antarctica is in danger of breaking away from the sea floor. Thwaites Glacier in Antarctica has an important breaking function. If it melts, numerous coastal cities would be flooded. That is why it is also known as the Doomsday Glacier. As a team of researchers from the USA has now found, the Thwaites could recede rapidly in the coming years. According to a study published in the journal Nature Geoscience, it is melting along its underwater edge as the world warms. The scientists documented a historic retreat of the mighty glacier. The Thwaites covers an area roughly the size of the U.S. state of Florida. 192,000 square kilometers together with Pine Island Glacier, it prevents the much larger West Antarctic ice sheet from flowing into the sea. If the glaciers could no longer guarantee this one day, the sea level would rise by more than one meter. Now the Thwaites could retreat quickly if it breaks away from a sea ridge. According to the researchers, this has already happened once sometime in the past two centuries. After that, the ice shelf receded at a rate of 2.1 kilometers a year twice as fast as in the past 10 years. It could be that time again soon. The Thwaites is holding on with its fingernails, said marine geophysicist and co-study author Robert Larder, according to CNN. One should expect that in the future there will be big changes in small periods of time. Concerns about the glacier are not new. Researchers discussed the stability of Thwaites as early as 1973, later finding out that warm ocean currents are melting the glacier from below. Since then, the glacier has been called the weak underbelly of the West Antarctic Ice Sheet. To study it again, an autonomous submarine was used to map the seabed. In recent years there have been repeated reports of large ice breakoffs in Antarctica. While this is a natural process, scientists are concerned about how quickly it happens. A study last year shows that the Thwaites ice shelf could break up within five years. The lost ice of the Thwaites already accounts for several percent of sea level rise.